touch with your internal thoughts what type of food you eat what type of thoughts you, that you put into your mind what type of thoughts that come out of your mind your mouth you got to be in touch with that and that thoughts and mind has to be in line with the god that god's life can come out of you because you cannot bear a big tree on the terrace maybe you can keep for some time bearing a putting a so huge uh, pot and so on for the beauty but you can't have a tree like a neem tree or something like that it will destroy the building so you have to put it on the ground so if greater things have to be produced in your life greater shade of the holy spirit has to be found in you your life has to be rooted in him for him to be rooted in you you should have the mud you should have his presence to have his presence you should have in internal cleansing so without internal cleansing don't expect the presence of god so the lord spoke to manova so they went that's why we read in the book of daniel chapter 1 verse 7 where daniel says how can i how can i receive the lord that the problem outside is so big but and the attack of the enemy is so big they are telling daniel you pray, you drink this wine you eat this food and be happy with the king he says no i don't i will not allow anything to defile me i will not allow anything to defile me the external food the external drink the external desires the external language that i talk will not be allowed to destroy the internal growth which god wants to give it to me so sorry i don't need this drink i will not allow anything to defile me whereby the god who wants to guide me will be prevented rather i will prepare myself in such a way that my god can easily enter into me hallelujah 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 that's why we read second corinthian 4 4 above all take care of your mind because it is through your mind when god wants to achieve something through you the enemy who wants to prevent that achievement will come to you by attacking your mind once your mind is conquered by him then the desire and plan of god's love or joy or power will be completely prevented from your life you will go to church to after church you will be crying after crying you will be doing novenas after novenas but fruits won't be found in you the second thing the lord teaches manava's wife is consultation and togetherness is the base to receive life in you consultation and togetherness god never created man to be alone either you have to be in a family or in a community you have a father you have a mother you have a husband you have a wife you have a children you have a superior you have your companions if it is community so god has put you together to be part of each other when a little finger is hurt the whole body is suffering though i my body is tired when my hand is hurt i can't sleep the whole system is affected yes so consultation and caring for one another is the base for the life of god to enter into us i don't talk with my wife i don't consult my husband i think because i am yearning so i can take you may take a decision and you may impose yourself to be the leader of your home or leader of whatever may be but the flowing of god will not be there 
you may be praying for grace the person who is hurt by you may be praying for curse upon you who knows maybe the person's peers you hit your wife and then you are praying to god lord change my wife and the tears of wife goes to god and says lord how cruel this man this man doesn't understand help him to understand so the prayers go in heaven fighting to god husband's prayer and wife's prayers maybe god will not know what to do at times life becomes a conflict because we don't learn to from the nature only the ground that gives it space allows the little seed to become a tree the more the trees grow to the earth the more that earth becomes beautiful and life giving by itself the earth doesn't produce life but when you plow it when the land allows itself to be plowed the and allow to be dug and allows the seed to grow the more the ground gives itself to another another completely different nature seed is different mud is different but if the mud gives space to the seed the seed becomes a tree yes if the sky are giving space to the stars the sky is brightened with the stars so we need to most of the time it is i who yearn it is i who live for myself and everybody should follow me that kind of nature destroys not only the families it also stops the divine grace and the spirit to flow into us no clouds take path in its own rain no tree eats its own fruits but still they bear fruits but still the clouds give their water and you and i carry life even if you receive it or not only in giving you receive only in dying you live only in forgiving you are being forgiven so if god tells manava's wife if you want it is not possible by you so manava's wife says wait wait i will go and call my husband the angel says yes that is the way go until you come then she says the uh, the wife says on but uh, if you disappear the angel says no you don't know the ways of god if you go and bring your husband that is the time you will see me fully so as an individual the wife she only saw the vision of the angel but when the husband came the revelation of what god is going to do through them is revealed most of the time when you pray alone maybe you may get nice vision ah oh, when i was praying i saw oh, some shaking some car, breeze came some light came hallelujah hallelujah i saw the vision faced unless you receive the revelation all that you see all that the external things maybe we when children love we give chocolates but chocolates are not the food for the growth uh, food is food chocolate is chocolate uh, don't get satisfied with the little little experience i had a this dream i had that vision i had th- no go beyond and to go beyond you need to move with the people whom god has given to you if you cannot move and love those whom god has given to you how do you expect god to move with you and to love you so immediately the wife and husband they came together and the husband brings the food and they put it on the on the rock and they say lord if you really accept us please accept the food sometime though god comes down from heaven to the earth still the man on this earth doesn't believe 
the God of heaven. He wants always assurance. Please, will you accept my food? Are God has come to be with you. But still, Manava and his wife, they are not satisfied. Will you accept what I give you? God says, okay. So the angel stood with them when they did not stand with God.